Michelob TV. It's your host, Michelob. We back again. And we about to get our grub on, man. You know, you know me, I love some barbecue. And look, I got my comedian homie with me this time. Dope boy. It's the real dope boy right here, man. Yeah, the real dope boy. Dope boy right here, man. And he about to go get his grub on with me. And where we at? Jesse Rice. Where it's all about the And this week on What It Tastes Like, we at Jesse Ray's Barbecue. And me and Doughboy about to see what it do. Hello TV, yeah, Doughboy yeah. about to go for the fortress, <laughs> y'all. It's never, it's never happened at Jesse Ray's. This is the fortress. I do the scale of one to a hundred. I give them about a Crazy thing is, I seen somebody's ass 
motherfucker car pulled up. Some dudes jumped out. Look, this nigga's ass over social media. Like, man, we talk about this shit on Facebook. Talk it now. Talk it now, nigga. But how you feel about it? What you think about that shit? I think that shit's crazy. You be keyboard game that be about that life. Right. You just gotta, you know, say decipher which one you talking to. Talk. <laughs> and you gotta, you gotta see which one. Now, if you talk to somebody, they keep saying, "Well, shoot me your location. I'm gonna fuck you up." That nigga might be about his shit. You might not want to fuck with him. You might just want to fuck with that dude that just want to just keep yapping, keep keyboard typing, this kind of words and shit. That nigga that be that just be done talking, but nigga, fuck all that. Where you at? Can I come see you? That might mean something. <laughs> yeah, that social media, man, that shit is uh, that shit is deadly. I, I say it's a, a blessing and a curse. You know, it's good for us to use to communicate with people abroad or other side of the earth or something and promote. Show people the upside of Earth shit that we probably never meet in our lifetime. It's good for that type of shit. But then it's, it's that flip side where you got fucking babies being born, human trafficking, OnlyFans, like all this crazy ass shit. Okay, motherfuckers doing some crazy shit. They ball out of control, but the dark side, the dark web, you know what I'm saying? There's just a lot of shit on there, man. Just, you know what? But they say you gotta take a good with the bad, right? I can trip it over, over the rappers. They be showcasing all that money. Not thinking these niggas out here going around. We've lost a lot of rappers, but they wanna show their location and shit. Yeah, I think it's, uh, I think it's more like, uh, um, I think it's a mental health problem, bro. To be honest with you. I don't think shit is really clicking right. Cause for you to be blessed like that, and then to just turn around and not care like that. Just because you trying to prove something to a bunch of nothing ass niggas or a bunch of broke motherfuckers that ain't got shit. You trying to prove something to them and you gonna risk all your shit to prove something to them. Yeah. And what are you gonna get from proving it to them once you prove it to them? What do you get from them? So when motherfuckers look at it like that, I think it's a mental health problem, man. Right? Something's not clicking right. You know what I'm saying? That's what I'll be thinking, bros. Hello, TV. It's your host, Rick Law. Appreciate my nigga Doughboy coming out. Grab a woman here, Jesse Rags. Y'all make sure y'all come here and get your grub on if you come to Las Vegas. Until next time, you know what you gotta do, right? You gotta hit that subscription button. You gotta hit the notification button so you know the new shit can come out of the next show where this type of shit is popping. Don't you like Love TV? Don't you like me bringing you this option? Until next time. Yeah! It's that time again! Oh, I get last words too? Mm -hmm. <laughs> be well, be well. Uh, my last words is uh, stay in school. Because it's cool. Uh, <laughs>